Welcome back to Fans, Lazy Gamer here. In this video, we'll talk about transparent textures and how to make them work in our map. Let's get started. So, transparent textures they look really neat, right? So let's add one to our wall. Let's see. Should be one here. So oh, there he is. Let's add it. It's gonna look cool. No, it doesn't. It's just the texture with some black stuff in it. So, uh, why is that? Well, transparent textures doesn't work like that because to be transparent, you have to have something to be transparent to. And this is just the void, which is black, and then we can't see it. So we have to use them in a specific manner. And for that, we'll need a line def inside our room, like so. Now, if we go and add yeah, yeah. Uh, this is the back side. See the peg. This is the front side and back. We, I explained that before, right? So go to back side and add our texture. Let's see how it looks in visual mode. Now it looks rather neat. Um, it has a setup that it requires maybe a wall in this case but at least it's transparent we can move it um, but oh where you go well I talked about front and back right so if we go here and add the same texture to front, it will be visible on both sides. Now, this is not a wall. Of course, here clearly you can duck under it too, but uh, pretend that it covers the entire uh, thing. If you go into the game now, you can still walk through it, like I can do here. And sometimes that's what you want to do, but if you wanted to block your character, you have to go in and make it impossible or block everything. For instance, and now we can't pass through it. I hope that was somewhat useful and explained uh, enough about transparent textures to uh, get you started. If you are uh, curious or just didn't get it, feel free to ask questions in the comment field below or on my Discord channel. In the meantime, this has been your host, The Lazy Gamer. Logging off. Bye, guys.